It's that time yet again to update our strategizer financial market model. Our June edition just got released and contained more interesting results. For one, the U.S. equity market looks like the clown of the circus blowing up the balloon with valuations and sentiment having gone completely off the charts to the point where the U.S. equity market scorecard is exactly where it was back in January 2022 at the peak, and we all know what happened next. The good news is that our model is not saying to run to the hills into cash. It's saying to run to the Canadian equity market, where our model score improved to 76 from 69 in May, and that 76 reading for the TSX compares to 24 for the S&P 500. Remember that the scorecard goes from zero at the worst to 100 at the best. Canada is at 76. The S&P 500 is at 24. This is one of the most glaring gaps in favor of the Canadian equity market on record. In fact, it classifies as a two standard deviation event and you always want to be investing around two standard deviation events. The main message here is for investors to immediately take profits in the extremely expensive U.S. market and deploy the proceeds north of the border. Within the Canadian space, it's the beaten down financials that are by far our top sector pick. Super attractive valuations bumping against super attractive dividend yields. From an overall asset mix perspective, the strategizer model has picked up on an even more constructive message on the U.S. Treasury market, even with this latest backup in yields in the face of, of vivid evidence of declining inflation. This is very compelling. Within the currency space, the U.S. dollar model continues to deteriorate that has positive implications for gold, but for more on that, you will want to have a read of our Strategizer report. And if you're interested in getting it or anything else we do at Rosenberg Research, please send us an email at information at rosenbergresearch.com. Until next time.